If this mud wasn't mud, then what would it be? It'd be anything that you would like it to be. Because there'd be no preconceived teachings filled with wassails and preaching, and we trust nothing but this disease speaking. Cause they got to us before TV. I started questioning the gods once I understood the laws of physics. Needed limits like a drunk drinking Guinness. But at the same juncture, I punctured my mind, trying to break the design that aids our decline as a makeshift planet overpopulated. Not to mention panic. God damn it, can't you think without the Xanax? What if this earth was just a ball of dirt and astroturf made by higher powers for personal quirks? And what if this universe was like a Sega Genesis made to amaze creatures we don't know exist? If the mud wasn't mud, then what would it be? It'd be anything that you would like it to be. So what's stopping me then from rolling around in it? It's obviously in my head now that's been done in it. But hey, what's the use of painting a perfect picture if the frame for which I wish to hang is too big to exist here? My feet leave a routine. Beauty floods the streets where the children play with mud and the sun stays out for weeks but me i'm tangled up in my umbilical cord trying to hang a little mistletoe above this uh trivial war and when the unpredictable storm swarming rolling there's some other keep my skin warm to form me for the moment that stole place from right under my face blacked out blind side of my doubt wrapped tightly in shrapnel i folded it into pieces and shoved it inside of my balloon but the sky is too polluted for me to do what i know i need to do to see too much if this mud, mud wasn't mud then what would it be it'd be anything that you would like it to be Character built his fortress. I thought this life was so fucking gorgeous, but see, the anguish is deeper than the language. Our forefathers forced us to paint with a brush. I'd rather cut the bristles and dismantle your missiles of deception with the handles. Painless rush of rust through your cranial crust until guts of guilt flush out of you like chunky milk. I'm the kid that ate shit and never died, and that alone proves that you lied. I'm the kid that ate shit and never died, and that alone proves that you lied. I'm the kid that ate shit and never died, and that alone proves that you lied. If the mud wasn't mud, then what would it be? It'd be anything that you would like it to be. And the lightning strikes a psyche right under primitive symbolism that might crack under pressure of rational thunder, black hole intuition, suction, abduction of infant innocence. Now grimmer like instincts run self built a steam engine in and out of experience, pulls toward merry go round, wonders a miracle spins around in comfort zones to avoid the suffering. But in a quiet, peaceful night, I feel the fighter in me die. I blow the wind and kiss and hope it drifts into a window sill. And I know deep inside the dream that occupies a sleep will soon keep a secret tied down long enough for it to sink in. All designs are set in stone. All designs have found a home All designs are set in stone I'm caught between rock bottom and the piece of me you own